You maybe walk the rest of it, Adam. Maybe walk it. <laughs> it's, too, it's too technical. The Alps to Ocean is a multi-day cycle trail starting in the Southern Alps of New Zealand's South Island and it takes you all the way out to the Pacific Ocean, finishing in the town of Omaru on the East Coast. Our band of riders consisted of myself, Adam and Tim and we were doing it over a period of three days. So it was on the bikes and setting off on day one. We are starting the Alps to Ocean at the Braemere Road at the, lake, the head of Lake Pukaki near Mount Cook and this is our big day because we're going all the way back to Omarama. Yeah, fairly large day but we're cracking on, the weather's nice and cool, should be good. Five kilometer report, feeling pretty good. We're just near the bottom of Lake Pukaki. Comes Tim. All going well, apart from a few creeks uh, from my derailleur on my bike. Right at number three. So that was coffee in the town of Twizel. We are 51 kilometers in and now sort of heading towards Ohau up into the hills and uh, yeah, sort of a little bit more of a backcountry section before we're out to Omarama. Lake Ohau Lodge we are at now for lunch and we've been joined by Sue who is our very kindly shuttle sh bunny we call it shuttle bunny and yeah. and caught us up on an e-bike don't us, say e caught us up on a bike <laughs> yeah. we're here for lunch we're looking forward to lunch <laughs> We are on the last section, 30 something k's from Lake Hoha Lodge to back to Amarama where we're staying. Feeling pretty good, we are at just, just gone over 90 kilometers and feeling relatively good. Yeah. Feeling good, slightly sore bottom this afternoon for the homeward leg. Yeah. And as I'm looking forward to Grant giving me a massage. <laughs> that ain't gonna happen. <laughs> On the the major climb of the day for, between Lake Ohau Lodge and Omarama so we're just about to clock 100 k's or we've biked 100 k's today so far which is fantastic feeling okay but I've got, to, I've got to be honest with you I'll be pretty stoked when we're over this hill Almost back, eight and a half hours. Uh, we've just gone over 123 kilometers. Seven hours, 15. 
Well, that's, that's moving time according to Adam's cycle computer. So, yeah, almost back. So, we've lost Sue. Sue's taking a wee rest. She's the real deal, that ride. Real deal. So, nine hours 13, we're on the go. 133 kilometers, I think. Two, two scones. Two scones, yeah. It was Bacon egg pie. 133 kilometers. So, yeah, great to be back. Great That's day. Good, good day. Yeah, that was a good ride. Yeah, enjoyed that. Adam's going to pick up Sue. <laughs> <laughs> Beer o'clock. Thank you. Cheers. Yeah. There's sausage in there as well. How's that tub? More protein. <laughs> I didn't have so much in my mouth. <laughs> you give us a great quote. I could tell you how good it is. Quick <laughs> meter. It's about the only time you'll see me behind you today, Grant. Yeah, thanks, Adam. Yeah, we'll see about that, Adam. <laughs> there he goes. Uh, day two. Bacon and eggs for breakfast, and we are heading from Omarama through to Kura. It's about 80 kilometers. Sun has just gone behind a cloud. It actually is looking pretty good for the day, so yeah. I have to say the butt is a bit sore from yesterday. <laughs> So we're just currently on a section, well this is Lake Benmore and the section between sort of the start of Lake Benmore and Otamatata and I have to say it's my favourite section so far. We're now just sort of heading around the side of Lake Aviemore, another hydro lake. Tim's behind me there. You see him in the distance, he's packed a bit of a sad because he saw how far we've got to ride down the lake, which is not that far. <laughs> Best swim of 2021. Tim, how are you feeling? Oh, I'm feeling reinvigorated, ready to go. Nice, that was fantastic. Feeling good. No sign of Adam who's charged on, not taking time to smell the roses. The cameraman, <laughs> Adam, the what's going on mate? We just literally just started, what's happened? Well, I was quite worried we hadn't had an accident on this trip, so I took one for the team. <laughs> Oh, You're right. I'm trying to put my glasses away. Oh, one man. hand, oh, right. and as I did, I just went bang. You maybe walk the rest of it, Adam. Maybe walk it. That's <laughs> too. That's too technical. That thing is cola is fantastic <laughs> after after a long day on the bike. So we're at Kurao, that was uh, a five and a half hour day, a little bit less case than we thought, I think around 70 kilometers, and we are here for tonight.
actually surprisingly good sleep last night in our little cabin here. And it is day three, this is our last day, and we are off from Kura, pushing through to the dest uh, final destination of Omaru. I saw some, there he goes, <laughs> gone. Here comes Adam, he's got his, he's got his blue, <laughs> he's got his Bluetooth speaker, he's gonna play some hard house and hip hop for the rest of our trip today. Oh, the body's feeling weak. <laughs> So the normal Alps to Ocean Trail from Kuran normally follows the river down there, but there's been a bit of flooding here in the last couple of weeks, so there's a couple of river sections that uh, have been washed out, so we've got to stay on the road for a few k's before we get back onto the trail, but it's kind of following the road back out to the coast to Omaru. Okay, Tim. Hey, mate. How are you going? Good, mate. How are you? Yeah, lovely. Little bit disappointed we're at the Duntroon Hotel and it doesn't open till 10 30 and it's only currently nine o'clock in the morning we were pretty keen for a coffee Forty-four kilometres into it, and we're just kind of winding out through the through the farmland now towards Omaru. Lots of there's been lots of flood damage, so there's been a few little, little diversions on the track. But yeah, very pleasant. and low lights of the trip you can talk to me if you want low light oh, to the oh, camera to you talk to me low what light, low light. to the camera we well, can talk to the camera if you want low lights of the trip stop walking uh, two, three days with grant the low light for me was probably actually the low light for me actually was probably along the canals by lake ohat uh oh i'm not sure i can repeat the low lights but something to do with the bathroom and tim highlight of the trip day two stage winning <laughs> highlight for me was the, the head of Lake Benmore right down to the bottom of Lake Aviemore. That was the bit I enjoyed the most. Highlights, gotta, gotta be day two on the Benmore. Outstanding, yeah. 